Taiwan, a democracy of 23.5 million, lives under the shadow of authoritarian China, which is threatening to invade if Taipei does not agree to Beijing's rule. For years, defense analysts have agreed that China does not have the ability to pull off the Herculean challenge of invading and occupying a mountainous island with few landing beaches. But heavy Chinese investment in its military capabilities has now changed that calculation. This week, Taiwan responded with a three-day Air Force, Naval and Army drill of its own, an annual event to underscore its battle readiness and to reassure the public ahead of the Lunar New Year holiday in late January. Today the Telegraph is on a military base in southern Taiwan where the army is demonstrating its ability to defend the island. We're currently watching an urban warfare drill. At an infantry training base in the southern city of Kaohsiung, two platoons divided into red and blue teams and battled for control of a mock city. The urban warfare exercise used a high-tech laser system to simulate a gunfight. Familiar signs depicting high street convenience stores, chemists, banks, and even the inclusion of an Irish pub added to the realistic scenario of street battles on an island where 90% of the population live in urban settings. China has sent more than 950 warplanes into Taiwan's air defense zone over the past year. Today we're in Chai Air Base where the Taiwanese Air Force are demonstrating how they respond to that threat. The base is already on the front line of intercepting Chinese warplanes, including nuclear bombers, that have entered Taiwan's air defense zone over the past year. The military is also investing more in coastal defence, identifying that the dangerous crossing of the Taiwan Strait is a weak spot in China's invasion strategy. Behind me is Taiwan's coastline, which would be the first landing point for Chinese forces. In front of me is the Taiwan Strait, where fierce sea battles would be taking place. It plans to use sea mines, coastal missiles, and rapid strike craft, like its Tuochong class corvettes, to boost its natural defences. Beijing is expected to intensify pressure on Taiwan this year by increasing air and naval exercises and economic coercion tactics. For now, Taiwan's drills are just simulations, but they show how seriously Taipei is taking the threat from China.